Today, we take you to a restaurant that brings the authentic flavors of Mexico to Taipei. Restaurant owners Eddie and Joe focus on the dishes that Eddie remembers from his childhood. The Mexican heritage chef moved to Taiwan two decades ago in his early 20s. After meeting his future wife, he knew he wanted to make Taiwan his home. His mom's cooking was a major inspiration when the restaurant was born. Now the couple are proud to take ownership of every step in the making of their dishes. Corn flour dough is pressed into a pancake, spread out flat and grilled until the delicious scent of corn fills the air. A golden crispy fried fish is placed on top, followed by slices of purple cabbage, cheese, coriander and salsa sauce. Finally, it's time for a squeeze of lemon. This fresh and flavorsome Mexican fish steak is ready to serve. The special enchilada consists of a tortilla fried in the pan until golden, rolled around Mexican spiced chicken and shredded cheese, then baked. Finally, a house tomato and vegetable sauce is drizzled on top. It's the chef's specialty. We use local southern organic corn. After we've brought it over ourselves, we boil it, stew it, grind it ourselves. We do everything ourselves. Of course, the dishes get his mom's approval, and lots of our Latino customers think this is Eddie's signature dish. Eddie was born and raised in Canada. His parents are Mexican. At the age of 23, he moved to Taiwan to teach English and coach soccer. After he met his wife, Jo, he decided to settle in Taiwan for good. The couple started this business together at first as a stall on Danshui Old Street. As business continued to get better and better, eventually they opened two restaurants. I was born in Canada, but my parents are both Mexican, and we always ate Mexican food at home. So when I was a kid, my mom taught us how to make it. When I moved to Taiwan and opened the restaurant, my mom helped a lot. Joe wanted to open a cafe at first, but as an immigrant, Eddie often felt nostalgic for home cooking. That's what led them to settle on a Mexican restaurant. They often rang Eddie's mom in the early days to consult on culinary dilemmas. Now Eddie has made a name for his own instincts as a cook. Taiwan, uh, there's a lot of foreign food in Taiwan because Taiwanese people are able to go out and try food from other countries. So I think it's much better now. In the beginning, there were no other Mexican restaurants. Eddie's restaurant serves up the meals he remembers from childhood, giving Taiwanese diners a taste of the real Mexico.